Why sometimes you men, you gotta stay, you gotta stay under the blood. You wives, you better, you better love your man. Look good to him. Don't just think you're married with him. You can look any old kind of way. No, sir. You better keep looking good and them negligees and everything. You better keep looking good and smelling good. I got him now. You may not be able to keep him. But honey, see he see you the way you look in the morning. But when he get on the job, that girl is already, her hair's already fixed. Hey Amen. She's already dressed and sitting way right up there. Cause see, she bleeds like the scripture. And I, if I be lifted up from the earth, I'll draw all men. Huh? Don't ain't like me. at the wrong time. You look at that man and think, honey, he's through. He's out of it. He's only out of it. Amen. <laughs> Viagra won't help him. Honey, something come along and them vibes go to moving. Man, he won't even need Viagra. Huh? Are you listening to me? talking about what can separate you from the love of God, your husband, and your wife if you ain't careful. Huh? Thank God. Yes, thank you, God. Lord, devil trying to take my husband. <laughs> huh? Amen. See? See, when you get mad and been mad a while, you got to do things to look good to one another. See, when y'all was sweet 16, it didn't make no difference. Honey, I was ready. When you start getting down the road a piece, you gotta kinda, amen. Help turn one another on here, yes. Hallelujah. And I ain't talking about no Bible reading. I'm, oh God, get away from here. Sometimes both of y'all think, honey, it's over with the both of us. But you know, <laughs> Barbara Amos says something. Honey, it's over. It's over with the both of us. But see, what's old to you is new to somebody else. Are you listening to me? I was talking about things to separate you from the love of God. How'd y'all get in there? 